that's no hesitation to a point to the spot it's a yellow card as well for Kawachi and I think it was a, a foul given against uh, Yase Arapi could have gone either way and the final shot even hit the hand oh. of Kawachi as well but I think it was a foul before that let's take a look at this again Good work again for Boris Kapitovic. That touch in there. Let's take a look. Now nah, it was given against handball for, for the handball, I think. Yeah, but he, wasn't it tucked in and wasn't he kind of turning away? Well, obviously, this will be looked at. And, but the referee had no hesitation at all. As soon as uh, he hit Kawachi's hands there, I think it did hit his hand from the shot. And uh, Boris Kapitovic, 100% from the penalty spot this season. Well, <laughs> either side of half-time, there have been some decisions that will certainly get people talking. There's going to be an on-field review. And that may not bode well. Now, we, we, we got to take a look at this again, and if, if it has been given for that handball, let's take a look at that again. Well, immediately you saw Kawachi kind of defend himself, like saying, I, I was tucked in. Your initial assessment, it was the handball that was it looked at rather than a foul, right? Yeah, I think it was given for the handball, because before that, I don't see any foul at all. This was the shot. Sure, it was given against uh, for the handball. Well, it was nothing else. Kawachi was given the card, wasn't he? <laughs> okay, this might be. He definitely now, hit the head. Was it? Was it jutting out the elbow? Yeah. So, so first, first, first of all, he was turning away. Uh, Kawachi, he didn't even look at the ball. He just turned away. I mean, he's tucked it in, isn't he, Chassis, or yeah, not? Yeah, it, it's, it's it's really... turning away, isn't he? Uh, he, it, he has to make that call now. Because he did turn away, but he did tuck his... Uh, he tried to tuck his elbow in. Uh, Kawachi. He's, he's almost trying to push his, put his back in the way, and... Oh, that's, like you said, who wants to be a referee, eh? This is a tough one. Uh, but I always have a problem with defenders with their hands. Which is a natural anyway, right? You're yeah, <laughs> you, you can't defend like oh, that. Oh, hold on. Did it touch his left? <laughs> his left hand? He may have been turning away, Shasi. I don't know. D was there a chance it might have hit his left hand? Oh, boy. I probably want a few more looks at that. <laughs> So, yeah, we are hearing that it is actually now about the left hand. Wow. As I was just um, sort of observing, that wasn't as tucked in as the right, which we initially thought was where the contact was. Yeah, but, but even if it hit the left hand, he was close to his body, wasn't right. it? So <laughs> now, now, now that question is how close is close and how tucked in is, yeah. you know, as you said, that whole that phrase unnatural position yeah and, but, but what i don't like to see as well and, and this is nothing to do with the penalty incident mm. boris kapitovic straight away asking for a yellow card it's it's ridiculous yeah you know you don't want to be seeing that as well <sighs> because I, there's no way he deliberately did that nah. Nah, as no in, way, as, of course as, not. as in kawachi of, of course not he was turning away yeah. anyway so yeah that's uh, always tough he doesn't. Oh, he's, he's not sure. Yeah. Because, and, and he's asking for help. He's asking for assistant, uh, oh, assistance. He's gone and with the penalty. And he's gone with the his on-field initial decision. Well, this has been <laughs> the last five minutes of the match, including the last couple of the first half. There have been big talking points. And, and again, it's it's he, the referee has got to go with what 
the rule book says. Right. That, that's the Correct. most important thing. But you just you're going by opinions and, and, and common sense, uh, my in my opinion, it wasn't a penalty. You know? Yeah. It's, uh, I tell you what, these days, handball is... Um, uh, it's, it's getting ridiculous. It's, it's, yeah. It's, it's a hard one. Very hard one for the officials. Here's Kapitovic, though. And he makes no mistake, continues that 100% record. And they have the lead here, Tampanese Rovers, against 10 man, Albrecht Nigata. Well, I think, he, as you would expect, uh, no mistakes from the penalty spot for Boris Kapitovic here, down low. Yeah, the motor did go the right way, but uh, the ball was already going in as he dived across. So, one nail, one man up. Everything going for Tampanese at the moment. 